right, we have a single wide for you today. I couldn't find the name of it, you guys, but I know it's on Clayton's. I'm pretty sure it's on the website. Well, this is a cute little single wide. This is for you ladies balling on a, or ladies and gentlemen, balling on a budget. Just want something for you, maybe for a single person or a retired couple looking to downsize. I think this is right cute. I'm wondering how many bedrooms is in it, but we're gonna go in and see right now. All right. So cute. Close the door. So this is the living room. Really nice. That's the front door. You have lots of space in the living room for to make it cozy. Here we have a recliner, two end tables, a coffee table, and an entry table. So you got good space in here. You have your counter here that divides the living room and the kitchen. Um, it doesn't have the overhang to put a stool, but you could get creative. I would put, I could put, see putting one on this side and one down on that side, just to sit there, maybe turn them sideways for extra seating since they can't go under. I would turn them sideways and it would just be extra seating. Yeah, very nice. Lots of cap counter space. This would be so nice to downsize to, or even for a single person. I could really see this. This is nice. Have an eating kitchen. Here's your refrigerator. Put some decor up there. Lots of cabinet space. You have a dishwasher in your counter. Yeah. Really nice. So pretty. So pretty. You have your utility room back here. Um, so your washer and dryer would go there. You have shelving over the washer and dryer. And this is a large space. So if you want to sit a desk in there or um, a, ref a deep freezer in this corner, you could, or you, just like this home, you could put some cute decor on the wall and call it a day. Okay. Now your back door is here. And this is a master. Has the same flooring in the master. Nice size master. Huge window. And this is the master bath. So you've got your tub, there you go. You have your tub and shower combo. You have a toilet there, okay. You have your sink here, and then you have your closet back here. Not a big closet, but you could totally have them add some more shelving here or on this wall to give you more space. And again, keep in mind, if it's just you, then you have at least one other bedroom that you could use for closet space. So. There you have it. Nice. Nice size bedroom. This is what you see walking into the kitchen and living room. And now I'm curious to see, is this a two bedroom? Or a one bedroom. Ah, it's a two bedroom. So you have your second bedroom here. 
<laughs> love it. Not quite as big as the master, but a nice size for a two bedroom. And then you have a deep closet there. So you could put lots of things in there and it has a light in there. Awesome. I could see me here if it was just me. I really could. And let's see the guest bathroom. All right, so you have tub and shower combo, got your sink and toilet there, and it's a nice size for a guest bathroom. More than enough. You could have a roommate, or you could have your master bedroom over here, and then have a closet. I, it, it's, I have a lot of clothes, you guys. I would totally make this one big closet if it was just me, or you could make it an office, or a guest bedroom, or a combination of the two. It's up to you. Really, really nice though. Nice single wide. D guys, I think you might like this one too. All right, see you later.